but I did not experience the jitter until I went into this room. So now there's no jitter in this room. Oh no, there was a slight jitter. I also just updated my computer today, so that might be it too. It always gets a little squirrely when I update it. But we'll keep the frames per second in the corner, just so we can keep an eye on those. Hello, Phil. Hey, man. Busy as ever, huh? Oh, fuck off. Now it's not jittering. I wonder if the, the fr FPS overlay causes it to jitter. Oh yeah. It started jittering again when I... I'm just trying to figure out the performance is issues and, and what ca what what's causing it. Oh, I can go up here. And it is jittering a lot now, like when I... Like when I have that overlay. But if I take the overlay away, does the jittering just stop? Interesting. It does seem to stop when the FPS frames per second overlay is not is not on. Oh no, it still kind of does it, but it seems like it's not as bad. I, I haven't. I didn't play the old demo. I, what? How does it? Oh, from what you're seeing so far, does it look about the same, or does it look like it has more polish from when you played it last time? Good evening, how can I help you? I'm going to save my money for now. Oh, yeah, that, that problem, yeah. Um, uh, I can't make up my mind, mayonnaise or mayonnaise, they're identical. Yeah, um, so the jitter thing, um, I actually ran into that in, in Starshift, and I, and I was able to, and now it's jittering pretty bad, and I don't know why. So, here's what I'm thinking. I, I want to, I, I want to, um... Yeah, it's, it's jittering pretty bad right now. Um, I, I want to I want to save the game. I want to save the game and reload it and see if it goes away. Cause see, it's like you guys can see it's really jittering now. Um, and uh, let me and let me open up my task manager to confirm that it's not for some reason my computer struggling with, with um, stats. And it, it does seem to jitter even in the small window. And there and my computer is not overstressed at all. So um so I'm gonna close it really quick and I'm gonna go right back in and then see if it goes away. Now I can explain how I how I was able to resolve the micro jitter. It still happens a little bit, but not nearly as bad as it as it used to for Starshift. Um but but it is, it is related to the pixie.js library file. And there's something in there that will um, make the jitter severely reduced if you are if you are running into jitter. It took me, I spent, uh, I spent a good two days figuring it out, like multiple hours per day, like where's the source of the fucking jitter? Because it really bugs me uh, when I see it in my own game. It, it bugs me less when I see it in other people's games, but when it's in my game, I get like, I'm like, ugh. I want the performance to be good. And see, now the jitter is gone, right? It looks like it's gone. Um, but I want to check. I want to. I want to see really quick, though. I want to see if if this game has the same problem with its library file. It, it, it'll only take a second. JavaScript. It's um. It's the library pixie.js. We're gonna open this up in notepad plus plus 
and we're going to go to garbage collection. We're going to go to... Uh, It's it's got it's how many times it's willing to check for garbage collection. Max checks or something like GC max something. Um, gar garbage. This dot count. Let's see, max settings settings max count. Settings dot GC dot max count. Okay. So this the settings dot max count. Okay, so this is different than the older um JS or than the older uh file. Because I don't know where those settings would be. And I don't see any settings in here. But see, whenever you see something like this, oh, here we go. Here we go. Yep, yep, the same error exists in this. So you see how um, how it's how it says default 3600? And you see here where it says GC max idle and it says 60 times 60? Um, no, there was a search function. I have it on the other screen. Um, but I it didn't find it because I didn't exactly know what it was called, right? So, uh, oh, and I accidentally had whole word only. Okay, so, but see, in the library file, you'll see code like this that's, that says um, 60 times 60 or 60 times 10. Now, if you just change it to the hard-coded value instead, change this to 600, change that one to 3600, uh, the jitter will go away. And um, I, I don't know how I figured that out, but somebody had a, somebody gave me a clue, and they they said I think the problem is related to garbage collection, but they didn't have a solution. So I so I just started searching the file for anything related to garbage collection because I was just gonna try something, and that's what the fix turned out to be. And I think I know why. The, my logic is that every single time something happens when you're using the game. If you ha if you have thirty six hundred versus sixty times sixty, that's completely different. Even though the number at the end is the same, thirty six hundred is not a calculation. Sixty times sixty is. So if this is happening like every single second, and it's sixty times sixty every sec. Sixty times sixty. Sixty times sixty. Sixty times sixty every second. That's a that's a lot different than thirty six hundred times whatever other calculation because it, it, it's usually probably 60 times 60 with something else that's a calculation and i think that it just can't handle too many things at once and computers are like that in general they 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 they, they act like you can do multiple things at the same time but computers are really set up to be like one thing at a time very quickly that you don't even notice so taking out as many calculations as possible that it has to do helps it and so i'm just going to save this because i know it's going to work um and i we shouldn't we shouldn't see any more jitter and that's the base library file that is not as that's not a plugin or a custom javascript or anything it's just the basic pixie uh javascript file <coughs> yep yep you're right Rathawood. it's one more calculation that it doesn't need to do and if an engine or, or a game is not optimized as well as it can be, that use, that small stuff turns into nightmares. So I think that the problem is gone now. Yeah, so it, like, definitely make the same changes to your pixie.js file and you'll get the if you've had micro jitters like what we just saw they'll they'll pretty much go away
And if you see any other code in the library files that is a calculation like that, when it could be a hard-coded value, just set it to a hard-coded value that's the same number, and it'll just optimize it. Awesome, yeah. It was driving me nuts. I was go I was pulling my hair out, going crazy about that. The but the micro jitter bug and finally figured it out. Jesus. Okay. Let's see. So we're going to the cafe. Now one thing I do notice about this part of town is it's in it's probably just because this game's not done yet, it's a demo, but this 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 town feels a little empty. 